Well, there's the latest look for spring from J.C. Penney's. You see it here on a model, and also illustrated in the back by artist Ty Wilson. Ty Wilson grew up in Kansas City, but has gone on to become a top New York fashion designer. You see his works in Harper's Bazaar. You see it in Vogue magazine. You see it in Women's Wear Daily. Well, he's back in town today, and we grabbed him, get a chance to visit with him. Those are beautiful drawings, Ty. Thank you. Thank you very much. Tell me about fashion illustrating. It is such a specific field, and it's such a stylized form of illustration. That's true. It's, I think, expression that you want to get across the essence of something. If you want to be very literal about um, what you want to show, take a photograph, you want to show every button, every scene. But if you want to show the essence of the woman or the man, you do an illustration to capture a mood. Or what I do is very gestural and very flowing, kind of spontaneous and mm -hmm. fun. And bold and exaggerated, the shoulders are always big and the waist small. Well, you know, that, that's the, the look now. Uh -huh. You know, uh, so when things go back to more natural body, more uh, A-line, then we'll change it. But right now, that's things broad and it lends itself to the way I draw. It lo let's look at some more of these. It looks to me like you do it in 30 seconds. <laughs> yeah, you know, it, it's so big and bold. Is that is that true? Yeah, that's very true. That's what it amounts to. You can kind of I see the clothes and I know pretty much what it needs to do and I have to get it out very fast. Why? Is speed uh, important to the, to the finished product? Well, I think the, the line is the most important thing and you have to do that gesture and just work it and get it out of your system. And it is very fast, very spontaneous. Well, you grew up in Kansas City. You went to the Kansas City Art Institute. Right. Worked for Hallmark right. as a designing greeting cards, I assume? Yes, I started out in um, process art, then went on to the creative division in books. And then was fashion always your goal? Fashion always was. Always first love. Something I ultimately wanted to get to was New York. Are fashion illustrators really uh, fashion designers to be? I don't know. That's an interesting question. Um, for myself, I think drawing it really satisfies what I want to do. Interpreting what Donna Karen is doing or what Halston's doing. You know, some of the pieces I did for the Penny's job. That's the, the, the hard work for me. That's what I like to get across. But you don't necessarily yearn to be a designer. No, no, there aren't any collections in me right now. Okay. You've also done billboards, uh, record albums, and uh, movie posters. Tell us about, and some Broadway show work. Right. The theater posters, well, I started, my first one was for a Noel Coward show called Hay Fever, which was very exciting to walk down Broadway and Times Square and see your poster there. Um, and the one that's coming out currently that's in New York is called Stagger Lee, and it's uh, a nice graphic. I mean, it really pops from subways and, and from, from the billboards and whatnot. Tie a lot of pounding the pavement in New York? Yeah. Oh, that's essential. That's very, you go through a lot of shoes. You carry a big black book. I've seen it. It's enormous and you just walk the streets. It helps you get through the traffic. You can <laughs> knock people out of the way quicker. <laughs> All right. Well, we're, excuse me. We're glad to have you back in town. We'll look for your work in the fashion magazines and on Broadway. Thanks, okay. Ty. Thank you. Dr. Bowen White is with us when we come back.